M6 Theatre were asked by Rochdale Council to run a consultation project with 12 to 14 year olds living in Rochdale. The Children's, Schools and Families Department wanted to know our thoughts and opinions on two important issues affecting young people's education. One, extended schools and two, family learning. The aims of the consultation were to find out how families and schools can work together to help us learn and what do we want extended schools to look like? Um, I think it's a good idea depending on which subjects it can do. Well, a lot of people I think can like to do languages after school because, I don't know, they might think of moving away when they get older. Or drama or something like that, something that's fun. I think it should do um, sporting activities and some like mechanical things like that. I think it's good because most of the people like um, they could get to know how good the school is and then um, they could like send their children in. I think it should have contests and skill of, and talents because in circle cycle some of us don't have talents like in football, we have talents like in cricket. I, I like drawing, like, what's it called? I like that. Sketching. And ceramics. Family learning is a simple idea but quite challenging to make it work well. It is about families and children learning together and from each other. Young people spend only a small part of their lives at school. In other words, we do a lot of learning away from school and formal education. Um, I wouldn't really like my parents to get involved because they're a bit embarrassing. Yeah, friends are. And I don't think parents really want to get involved because they have not that much time because they've got jobs and stuff. I like it uh, because uh, you could get good stuff but I wouldn't like them talking to your teachers in case like you said bad stuff to them and you get them. What is an extended school? They want to see all secondary schools open from 8am to 6pm all year round. The idea is extended schools will provide a range of services and activities, often after the normal school day finishes, to help meet the needs of children, their families and the wider community. Science, because I'm not really that good at science, so I like to learn a bit more about science. I'd like to see like more sports activities, because like at my primary school, like Man United and Rochdale and stuff like that, I just came to train you, and I, I enjoyed stuff like that. Mm. Yeah, sports stuff's good. And more practical working subjects and make lessons more fun. More PE lessons, more sports activities after school. I think that it's good that the other community will be able to use the schools for different, for the extended schools because then they can get to know the pupils a bit better and they'll be able to know what the schools actually like instead of them judging. We need a skateboarding pitch for the skateboarders and a proper football pitch for us. And they should drop out some subjects, subjects like history because we don't really need to know about the past because we don't have anything to do with it. So we should know the things about the future, what's going to happen in it, and everything, and what we need to do, and we need to like, learn in our later life, when we like, get married and everything. What we need to do, like, paying bills. <laughs> like, quad biking, stuff like uh... M6 works with young people from three high schools in Rochdale. Phelan's Park High School, Hayward Community School, and St Cuthbert's Roman Catholic High School. But it'd be good if people like um, professional sports players could come in and give us all like one-to-one -one practice. Extended drama. Yeah, all that drama. Really good drama. Or, or professional footballs, or singing lessons with Sharon Ward. I don't know, Stephen that. Gerrard. Yeah, that. They chose the chapel over a swimming pool, pool when not a lot of people go to, to the chapel. So I think they should have a swimming pool instead. Yeah, I want my DJ lesson. <laughs> that was cool. I'd like some dance classes to start up, um, where like the community can come. I don't just want people from our school, like younger kids as well. After school club, yeah, we would, yeah. I'd stay behind. Like we're already staying behind, we're doing cheerleading on the Tuesday after school. From but, quarter past three to quarter past four. But you shouldn't have to pay for them because it's just... Like, you, you you won't get more people coming. The things like change if teachers, uh, children could teach teachers after school, like have a few lessons, like kids are teaching the teachers from all this area.
like trips after school that are this educational as well as fun ones sometimes that parents and families come from home just not kids from school like the community can come from I'd, I'd like to see a like, chill out room as well where you could just go and like relax at break or something and just hang out with your mates rather than wondering about, wondering what to do. Because yeah, there is a year centre but that's really boring and it's just like there's nothing to do in there and the teachers are there as well so you can't like say what you want so um, there's just like hardly anything to do in there. The consultation with schools aims to explore the issues from the point of view of the students, to generate discussion and gather information and opinions. In other words, what the young people think the schools should provide in extended hours, and what kind of family involvement in our learning would be like. M6 used a variety of drama techniques to get us talking freely and expressing opinions. We did loads of different exercises such as lots of fun warm-up games, singing songs and writing lyrics image theatre, character work and hot seating, forum theatre, spending fair money on our favourite ideas for activities and video diaries. I think my mum, because my mum's a only parent because I think, but I think my mum will actually enjoy it because she'll be able to come in, she'll be able to see my talents and see what I've learnt in sports and stuff like that. What it should be, we should let our parents come into school oh, no. because, because they put more pressure on us in, in school. We want to get away from them for a bit and like chill out. And parents would be good as well because they'll be able to see like what their kids are good at. Because like, I'm not being beginning, but I like drama and I think I'm okay. At it. So, <laughs> and so I like that my mum and dad to finally see something that I am good at. We also did a short research task asking to find out the thoughts of our parents and carers. This exercise was great because it asked us to put ourselves in the shoes of someone older that is connected to our school. It made us think about what they would like from the school and how they felt about young people's education. We love our clubs and what fun subjects, dancing, acting and fashion design. People from other schools are welcome as well, but not our parents, my clubs are mine. If they come, it would just be embarrassing. They can have a club just to themselves. They can still help with homework at home because that is what they're good at for us. Brilliant. I wish we had clubs in school. Drama clubs, dance clubs are all very good. When will it be my day when people listen to what I say? So sick of maths classes, so tired of school. So why can't we just get some good activities for once? So done with algebra, so done with Shakespeare. So why can't we get some tools in here? I woke up in the morning and I asked myself, is he going? It's like worth living, seeing my name. He, he, he a lot of people looking for me when I'm at home drinking tea. So why do people attend school? Music, dancing and sports. I like to see tennis on the tennis courts. I want to see changes. I want to see new. Lots of debates and presentations too Instead of chatting and sitting around we Watch our own version of the news round I want to see pupils making a change Mass English science is all the same No need for arguing, no need for fights No need for children doing wrong and not right These are the things that Thank <laughs> you.